Never encouraged as a child to brush his teeth, a nervous Jay is here to see implantologist Dr. Zaki Kanan. I'm in taxi. Jay's greatly improved his dental hygiene, making him ideal for implants. But the rotten teeth must come out. As he sits in the chair, his phobia of the dentist sets in. OK, how are you feeling? Probably. Your, your heart races a bit. But he manages to hold it together and after a generous dose of anaesthetic, he's ready for the pushing and pulling to begin. The difficulty is with Jay, you can see the teeth are really um, decayed uh, and they've, they've already started crumbling, so I'm just try and get it out in one piece. Once the teeth are out, the cavities have to be cleaned before the first part of the implants can be screwed in. This is the longest one, that's 18 millimetres long. Each implant acts as a replacement root of a tooth. The titanium base is screwed into the jawbone so that false teeth can be later fixed on top with dental cement. If your gums are still healthy like Jay's, implants are effective but expensive. A less intricate option would be to have partial dentures fitted. In two hours, Jay's had 11 teeth removed and the base of each implant screwed in. Dr James gives him some temporary dentures to wear until his new teeth are ready. We'll see if this treatment will bring a smile to Jay's face later. If you want cupcake... Cheers. Twenty-one-year-old Jay came to Dr. James with putrid, painful pegs. Too many fizzy drinks and a lack of brushing meant his teeth had rotted into stubs. It's sort of change your lifestyle times. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Jay promised to transform his bad habits, so one mass extraction later, and he had the first stage of implants screwed in. After two months of healing, a new look Jay is ready for the final permanent teeth to be fitted. Shaving off the beard and going a little bit of a haircut. Um, the reason for that is I had the beard to hide my teeth, like, so that people wouldn't really spot it that much. So what we have here is we've got Jay's teeth. They've just arrived back from the laboratory. They've been custom matched to his own teeth, a perfect colour match. And it's exciting to think really that just in a few minutes we're going to see what difference these teeth make to, to Jay's confidence. Hi Jay, how you doing? Uh, good. good to see you, have a seat. So Jay, today's the big day. We're actually going to screw your new crown and bridge work onto the implants and give you back your new smile. Excited? Yeah, very good. Good, me too. Let's go. With part of the implants already set into his jaw, small metal posts are screwed in. Okay Jay, I'm just going to stick these ones onto the right hand side. Jay's new artificial teeth are placed on top of these posts and fixed with dental cement, completing his implants. It's looking brilliant. Yeah, absolutely perfect. Just what we wanted. A few final touches and it's hello to Jay's new dazzling smile. OK, Jay, so that's us done for the moment. Let's sit you up and we'll show you what we've got. OK, just give me a big smile so I can have a look first of all. Looking good, looking good. Moment of truth. Here's the mirror, have a look and give yourself a big smile. What do you think? What's your first impressions? They look a lot better. I feel a lot more confident with a better smile now. Yeah. Just five months ago, Jay had severely neglected teeth. 11 teeth removed and replacement dental implants have given him a new smile. 